Hey everybody, it is a T3T, and this week we got a new guy on here, Mr. Ben Bailey. Alright, Ben Bailey, so you are brand new to the team here at St. Mary's Episcopal Church in Stewart, Florida. So, so what do you do here? Well, I'm in communications. I basically take what you and Father Todd and the rest of the team want to communicate and put that out to the community. And we uh, we do all kinds of great graphics and have fun with it. Yeah, so all the really awesome stuff you've been seeing with the news and events, all the different changes, that's this guy. In any event, you get to meet him and now he gets to tell you about the top three things. Okay, so numero uno. All right, is, um, so this Sunday for the sermon series is called The Frozen Chosen. It's all about the beloved community. So since we have Frozen in the title, we've got to reference let it go, let it go. We will have a frozen theme sermon this Sunday at CFW. So for all of you who love the movie, you don't have to be just be a kid, but I'm just gonna gesticulate a lot during this video. Have your kids dress up as their favorite frozen character. Yes. We will make this about Jesus, don't worry. Yeah. It's not just gonna be shtick. But yeah. yes, uh, have them come up. Princess, okay. Princess Jasmine, Aladdin, uh, Abu, some, those Monkey. are not frozen characters. Uh, those are even warm and those are warm environments. Yeah. Oh, so you got Anna, right? Uh, the she, horse. The, no, the, the snowman. Oh yeah, there's a horse and there's a snowman. Yes, and uh, there's a. Do you want to build a snowman? Do you want to build? Yes, and then Olaf is the Olaf. Snowman. Yes. Uh, yeah, let's do that. So it's a frozen Sunday. Come and then um, it will be a good celebration of that. Um, you can do it at all services, but really at CFW. Number two. All right. So I haven't gone to church here per se for indefinitely, but every year we've got we've got great friends and family in this community, and we go to church down the street. But still, every year we come on this upcoming Sunday for trunk or treat, which is so fun. It's right in the bigger parking lot. What building is that? Uh, Pinterest Center parking yes, lot. Yes, the Pinterest Center parking lot. It's over there. Uh, if you guys want to do some trunks, you want to decorate, you want to have fun, come bring them. Bring them at about four. For the rest of you guys that want to just come and have fun with your kids or with your spouse or by yourself, whatever you want to do, you come on in. It's awesome. It is so much fun. I've got three little kids. They all love it. The teenagers love it. The teenagers these days. Uh, we have a lot of fun. And then after that, what the best, my personal favorite as daddy, uh -huh. is the chili cook-off. So legit. We've got like six tables spread out. We've got all the accoutrements, if you will. So there's all kinds of different chilies. People are coming in, volunteers, you're making your own chili. If you want to make chili, you can contact, I guess, who would you contact in that? Ah, uh, you can correct, Tammy, Tammy Larkin. Tammy so Larkin. this is an outreach. This is all about outreach. All benefits go towards the outreach uh, committee. And there'll be some communicating, that's why. There will be communicating, that's why. I'm, that's why you're there. there. Anytime yes. we're communicating, not Ben has to be there. So yes. that's why he's here. Correct. We're communicating. And that's what, we, got a, we just had a communications meeting following communications regarding the communications at the church that we communicated about. Yes, so we're all communicated out. Three, All Saints Day is coming up. It's a big deal here. So that's gonna be coming up next week, November 3rd, 2nd and 3rd. We will change our schedules. A 5 p.m. service, a 7.30, two nines. We're back to the dueling nine o'clocks and then an 11 o'clock service. So make sure you get that down. Now also, since it's All Saints Day, we're honoring all the saints um, and all the saints that are here and all the saints that have passed on. So you will get a form that will be uh, an insert into your program this week to write down um, deceased family members, right? Yes. So we're, this is, involves communications. Exactly, yeah. So there'll be a form you can fill out. You just simply put your loved ones that you want to honor for All Saints Day. Simple as that. Didn't have to be that long-winded. Well, that's why you're in communications. Hey, you, yes. You, 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 you exercise brevity. Peace. Bye.